support it for it since they're they going to be playing a homecoming uh, game. Around the band, we're going to play a game. Uh, this is the, the parade's <laughs> kind of the band's moment. And, uh, and tonight, though, the, the uh, Husky Fast football team will take center stage. They're off to a great start, having a great season. They are. They'll be playing Thompson tonight. Um, Coach Josh Floyd really has this team going. Uh, Coach Rudy Griffin, defense coordinator, has the defense playing really, really well. We've got a lot of top prospects on this team. We've got a Stanford commit. We have got an Ole Miss commit. And we've got several other players that are getting attention from Division I and smaller schools. So a lot of these players are going to continue their career after their, their Hewitt Trustful days. And it's kind of exciting to it see is, all this. It is, and that's always great for Trustful, too, for these kids to go off and it continue is. to do great, great things. It is. And we, we need to mention, of course, we're here at the Hewitt Trustful homecoming, mm -hmm. but it's also Clay Chalkville's it is. homecoming tonight. It is. Uh, I was accused of wearing Clay Chalkville's I, colors. I, I made didn't, that accusation. I didn't think of that when I got dressed, <laughs> but we're, we're huge supporters of the Clay Chalkville Cougars. That's right. uh, Coach Jerry uh, Hood has that program going. They're on a long winning streak, defending 6A champions. They'll be playing their homecoming tonight. They won't have a parade. They're having the Cougar Walk okay. in, in place of that. But we want to want to know want them to know that we will have Tribune people there covering them tonight. Absolutely. We're pulling for them. We hope they have a great night. Pinson Valley, uh, I think, is off this week. But uh, all three teams are part of the Tribune family, and, and we're wishing both of those schools well. And we'll well. have all that coverage tomorrow night on the Trustful Tribune's Facebook page That's and right. on the website and all the highlights That's and right. pictures and everything everybody wants That's to right. see. We'll, we'll have the live game updates on our Facebook page tonight. We'll have game stories tomorrow up tonight. Night. Today's Thursday. Oh, that's right. It's, <laughs> I'm ahead of myself. Uh, you're right. That'll be tomorrow night. And uh, then we'll have game stories up Friday night. And then don't forget, every Tuesday we have Tribune Sports Live uh, with Dr. Zach Steele and Alan Taylor. Well, we do, uh, we provide the highlights from all three of our schools. We have interviews with coaches, interviews with players, and we announce our players of the week every week. So that's, right. that's every Tuesday night at TrustfulTribune.com. Really, really proud of that show. And those guys do a great, great job with that They're show. They're fantastic. They're having fun with it, aren't They're they? They're fantastic. Uh, Zach Steele is a former college athlete, so he, he knows his way around. Alan Taylor was the voice of the Huskies for 10 years, uh, and Alan is just absorbed with high school football. Uh, he's always followed the Huskies. I think he's gotten a real kick out of getting involved with uh, Clay Shaltwell and, and, and beginning to understand and know that problem uh, or the, that program. He has known Jerry Hood since Jerry Hood was a little boy. Oh, wow. Yes, and, and so Alan is, is really excited about that. They love Matt Glover over at Pinson Valley, and, and Alan uh, has, has really – thrown himself into knowing all three of these programs and it shows every it week on show. Tribune Sports really Live. Does. So it's a good deal. All right. Now are they getting closer? I think I was starting to hear. I, thought... I think they've blocked off Main Street. Okay. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna flip over to the camera okay. that'll show Main Street now. Okay. And uh, you and I'll step away and, and we'll just kind of watch the traffic. We'll go ahead and talk a little bit about our, our sponsors some more but uh, we'll let we'll just let our uh, viewers Get a view of what's happening. Okay. You're seeing the last bit of traffic coming down now. Okay, because I thought I thought yeah. I heard them coming, but not quite yet. But they're well, getting close. Why don't we take a short break? We'll just let the cameras roll, and, and we'll pick up again in just a minute or that two. That sounds great. Okay. Okay. Okay, Brandon, we're uh, going to have a parade here in just a minute. The, the <laughs> uh, parade has turned onto Main Street. They'll I hear be it. they'll be reaching us soon. Let's talk a little more about our sponsors, Lee Marlowe of Realty South and uh, Complete Cleaners. You know, Lee has been in Trustful. She loves everything about this community. She's lived here for 18 years. She's raising her family here, growing her business here. She's an active member of the community. <laughs> She's involved in several civic clubs past president of the Eastern Women's Junior Committee of 50, uh, supported team, the team does such great work. They really do. In this community. Uh, she and her husband, Tyler, are members at Holy Infant Catholic Church, always been involved with the schools, always been involved with the chamber. 
everywhere you go, you see Lee Marlowe. If you don't see Lee Marlowe, you see a Lee Marlowe real estate sign. <laughs> she is she has got to be one of the top realtors in the community. My wife and I have worked with Lee. She goes above and beyond for her customers in ways that we've never seen before. She's she's just an outstanding realtor and an outstanding community member. And we're happy to have her in Trustful, and we're happy that she did this for us today. And we are also um, so happy that Complete Cleaners is a homecoming parade sponsor. We can see the fire truck coming down right now with yep, the here band come the fire behind them. And we mentioned earlier that Complete Cleaners, they've been here since 1964. That's right. But they're also a sponsor of the Husky Band. They are. They play such an important role in keeping those band uniforms clean because you know so many people think that the band just shows up for the friday night football games but the band this is competition right. season for the marching band it is and it is it is and that's their top priority that's right big winners to go out on saturday and and, and compete in those competitions against other major right. schools you know we we mentioned we mentioned earlier that Complete Cleaners has delivery and pickup service. Right. A lot of people may not be aware of that. It's free. It doesn't cost a dime see, for them know. to pick it up and bring it to your home. And if you're not interested in that, their locations are so convenient. Regardless where you, of where you live in Trustful, one at Tuckwaller area That's right. and one right outside of Carrington. Right outside of Carrington. So easy on both ends of town. That's, that's pretty good. <laughs> and pretty smart marketing pretty smart. by that's that right. group. They're great folks there, and they will take really good care of they you. They really will. All right, and here we come with the uh, Trustful Fire Department right up front. And as I always like to say, it's, it's not a parade until the Husky Band shows That's up. That's right. But here they come. But before we jump to the parade, too, let's mention that the um, National Merit Semifinalists and Commended Scholars are on the fire truck. Yes, they, they are. Um, do you have a list of those people? Yes, those kids are Cortland Bonds, Margaret McBride, John Carver, Ivy Knoll, Nick Romano, and Garland Shorter. So those kids are being highlighted today on the on the Trustful Fire Truck. That's great, and we're proud of our National Merit Scholars. Uh, they do a, they do a great job in the classroom. I know their parents are proud of them. There they are. Maybe they'll wave to us. <laughs> They're in the back seat of the uh, of the fire truck. Here comes the band, my favorite part of the, of the parade. That's right. That's the high steppers out front, Brandon. Yes, I remember. I was a high stepper. You were a high stepper. Right. I've seen pictures. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> yes, I have. They are a great bunch of young women, and they do a great job. Love the color guard. always amazed at the number of flags that come through with the color guard. I know it. This they is really such a, a big job. band and so talented. The next up we have our um, Grand Marshal, Danny Garrett. Yes, Danny Garrett is our state representative. Uh, Danny's in his first term. He's done a great job. Uh, really proud of Danny and our state senators, uh, Shay Shellnut and Slade Blackwell. All of them are doing a great job. But Danny uh, has done a, a, a really fantastic job of making sure Trustful is real, well represented in Montgomery. And there's the superintendent, Dr. Patty Neal. Dr. Patty Neal. pretty fantastic. That's right. She looks great. <laughs> <laughs> okay, who do we have here? Do we have our lineup? I do. This is the varsity cheerleaders and the football players. Okay, these are the guys that will be center stage tonight. They are having a great season. Husky Fast is uh, is the word of the word of the year this year. They're they're off to a big time start. Uh, I think I mentioned earlier we have um, let's see uh, Bailey is headed to Stanford and we have um, a tailback. I'm sorry, I can't. Jared headed to uh, Ole Miss. How many guys are on this team this year? There's a lot know. of young I would, men. I would guess there are about 80 to 90 guys on the team. And coming up behind them, there's, Co there's Coach Floyd. There uh, he is. Yep, coming up I see. near the near the end of the line. There's the wave. Uh, yeah, they'll be playing Thompson tonight. We need to mention uh, tomorrow, tomorrow night. You night, yep. to, reminded me several times. <laughs> they'll be playing Thompson, and that's an interesting matchup because the Thompson coach from Spanish Fort, one of the winningest coaches in state history, private school and public school, and uh, we'll see how we match up against Jeff Freeman from Thompson. Now, here in our next float, the Husky pups. 
the future Huskies. This looks like the coaches' wives and families. The coaches' wives. Okay. <laughs> these are the these are the people that make our coaches great. They do a good job for us, and uh, and they keep our coaches straight. I, I, let's go ahead and say that. There's our high school principal, Tim Salem, and the rest principal. of his administrators. That's right. Got the whole crew there. Let's see. We got more. These are more high school administrators. Yes. And then it says senior board. Did we miss senior board? I, I'm not sure if we did. We, we, it looks like we're starting like with the homecoming court. This is uh, Lucy, Lucy Reinholz and Ben, ben Webland yep, on, the on the senior court. court. Eli Rollins and Emily Campbell. And behind those two are Anna Inman and Zach Thomas. Yeah, and Zach Thomas just also happens to be our quarterback. He is having Imagine a fantastic <laughs> season. And then... Emily Bessie and Sophie Olzak. And Jason Collins. And Jason Collins. Also on the senior court. Josh Monsky. Ansley Cross are on the senior court. Josh is one of our basketball players. He's getting warmed up. His season will start just in a minute. And then we have Annalie Cole and Jason Williams. Jason Williams, one of our great defensive players on the Husky football team. I tell you what, you you take the hard names, I'll take the easy ones, that, and it'll work out that, fine. That sounds terrible, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> now, oh, Here's what a great board. quote that they have. Is that Let's not see. cool? Yes, very nice. <laughs> so these are the seniors of the class of 2016. This will be their last yeah. homecoming as students. Their next one, they'll be back as alumnus. This is the International Club. I'm not sure what the International Club does. I'm not either, and I didn't see them on my but list But it sounds like a good club it to does, be in, does and we're it? glad to have them. <laughs> is that the Student Council? Let's see. Oh, I can't figure out. I yes, they're, they're, they're the SCA. All right, so the Student Council and, and the International Club. Club. Okay. There's our uh, fire chief, Russell Ledbetter, in the Jeep. Okay. And, hey, it's Turn Trustful Pink Month, you know. Which is very important. It is. It's Bring a big deal here at the Tribune. about breast cancer. Lots of events going on this month. It really is. Trust, it really is. And breast care awareness, of, obviously, is a great cause. Uh, what Joshua White has done with Turn Trustful Pink is amazing. This is the wo uh, Wounded Warriors Flow. That's, a, that's a talk about worthy causes. There you go. Okay, we've got some more um, homecoming court. This is this is the junior court. It says Hannah and Drew. Do we have last names for Hannah and Drew? Let's see, I do. You look, and I'll keep I'll keep up with the ones coming. Here comes Grayson Cash and Olivia Lawson. They're juniors. Grayson's another one of our great football players. Proud of Grayson and the job he does every week. And before that was Hannah, Rosetta, and Drew Williams. Okay. And in this car, we've got Sarah Koshat and Nathan Vaughn. Nathan's also another one on of our great ball court. players. We've got a lot of football players in this court. Here comes another one. This okay, we just got first names here, Rose Let's and see. Christian. We've got Rose Lambert and Christian Smith. Okay, there you go. I hope, I hope our football team isn't too preoccupied <laughs> with uh, being in the, in the football court. But they're, they're riding they're in quarter, yeah, riding in convertibles and looking good. <laughs> you know, right. I, I think that's uh, something they can handle without being distracted. This is their week. After Here comes Hewitt Trustful softball. Coach Karen Johns, they made it to the state playoffs last year, had a great season. And I know they're looking to have a have a big season again this year. And then after softball. There's that softball team. Yes. Big time they winners ladies. right there. <laughs> looking good in their uniforms today. Here comes the engineering club. This is oh, an amazing group of students. Uh, I think these cars are solar powered. I'm not positive about that, but I believe they are. There comes their sponsor, Jason Dooley. This is just, uh, this is one of our academic uh, superstars right here. These guys are special. And I hope everybody got a look at those um, cars. That, those were really, really cool. All right, here we've got more cheerleaders. Cheerleaders this is always make the parade the look JV so good. The JV cheerleaders. The JV cheerleaders. There they are. In the, uh, now they're ready for Thompson too. Trash Thompson. And this is a pretty uh, active float we've got coming up. This is the um, sophomore board. The sophomore board. Okay. The boards have done a great job with their floats. They have done a great job. What have we got? The sophomore and sophomore court. court. This is 
Claire and Desi. Claire King and Desi Gillespie. All right, and now we've got Anna Cochran and Lee Reagan. Also in the sophomore court. And Grayson Byram and Olivia Harwell. All right. And another one coming up with Tate Mosley, Logan Pitts, Jalen Reese. There you go. Also part of the sophomore of homecoming court. And then behind them are the future business leaders of America. A club let's, that's been around for a long time. They have been oh, around for friends. a long time. And let's hope they are really preparing themselves for the future. Uh, America needs them right now. They do. We need them in the workforce fast. What do we got here? Let's see. Spanish club. The Spanish club. I, you could probably tell us a couple of things. Well, <laughs> I'm wondering where the gorgeous sponsor for Spanish club <laughs> is. She's my, uh, she's my wife. <laughs> and actually, Lori may not be the sponsor this year. I don't know, but she's around the corner, and I think some of the students just spotted her. And then be, um, the Academy of Finance has a, a, a nice little float there. That's great. Let's see. Is that FCA? <laughs> you know what? I can't tell. No, that's Spanish Club. That's still Spanish Club. Still Spanish Club. And they're uh, they're celebrating the Day of the Dead. I see the skull <laughs> on the back. I noticed that. Yeah. And then somewhere in here we should have the Life Skills Academy, which may be those guys. Which academy? The Life Skills Academy. Okay. And here's the freshman court. This is Jacob, Jacob Bishop, Bishop, Creed Parker, and Suzanne Volts. Okay. And then freshman homecoming princesses Meryl Bettis, Bettis. Uh -huh. and, and Denny Moore. There you go. Now we've got Kelly Dunn and, David, and Davis Ennis. And behind them we have Anna Catherine Summers and Miles Taylor. We've got some great looking kids here in Trussell. We have do. you noticed that? I have noticed. Maybe it's something in the water. There's some coming up behind them too. There's some the, cute kids well, I'm, that way. Well, <laughs> I'm trying to raise one myself, but I know you are too. <laughs> You're raising a couple of them. Yes. Ready, set, glow. Is this cross country? It this could. I don't know. Yes, it is cross country. The cross country I see the team. XC on the shirts. That's our coach. David Dobbs does a great job with that group. He has been there forever. They are national contenders year in and year out. Now the recycling club. We've got a lot of clubs. We do. We do. Do, do and they I have like time to go to class? I don't know. They're pretty busy. <laughs> Let's see who we got here. Oh, First Baptist Church Preschool Ministry. That's there right. you go. And the children's ministry. The I First think that's Baptist from First Church. Baptist as well. It yep. is. Okay, here we come with some of our uh, city councilmen. On the antique fire truck, there's Councilman Brian Plant, Councilman Perry Cook. And behind them, members of the Historical Society. Well, that'll be Brian's wife, Donette. She's waving to us right now. And look, everything Christmas is coming up. The Arts and Crafts Show at the Civic Center. That starts November 21st, November 20th and 21st. That's a huge event. It Brandon. is, and this we'll have some more popular. information about that yes, as we, as we get Here comes to the time. Dog Pound. This is my favorite uh, group in the parade. Next to the band is the Dog Pound. Uh, the student sections at all the schools we cover do a great job. They do, and they have a, a really good time. And their sponsor is Vanessa Romano, who There's headed Vanessa. up the parade this year, and she really did a great job. She did a great job. It's well organized. And the best thing is it's in pretty good order this year. The, following uh, the dog pound, that's Officer Rosetta. He is one of our SROs at the high school. He's there every day. And the other police truck is uh, Chuck Bradford, another one of our SROs. They do a great job keeping our kids safe uh, in, in developing a line of communication with our students. It's very, very important. And that's so uh, important in yeah. every school across America that's right, right. now. That's right. Really, to really have proud them. of our police department here in Trussell. They've done a great job. Brandon, I think that's going to wrap up the parade. I think it is. We need to mention our sponsors one more Let's time. Let's do it we one more time. We wouldn't be here without them. Well, I'm going to uh, mention Complete Cleaners again, who do a great job, have two locations at either end of Highway 11. They are the sponsors of the Husky Band. They keep That's those right. uniforms clean every week, and they um, helped bring this parade to the rest of the community who couldn't come out to collect candy today. That's right. And let's remind people once more, they do have free pickup and delivery. They do. Uh, no charge. They pick up your dirty laundry, bring back clean laundry. It's it's like a, a ferry, a laundry ferry, <laughs> if you will, you know. Uh, they Hard just, to beat. They just take care of everything. And also, 
also want to thank Lee Marlowe at Realty South. We appreciate all that Lee does for the community, all that she does for the Trustful Tribune. And if you need a realtor, Lee's the best. That's right. Well, Scott, this was a this was great. We had lots of people come out for the parade today, as Trustful always does. And um, thanks for having me and let me be here with you today. Absolutely, it was great. Let's thank uh, Jason Bradley, our producer on right. on all things Tribune, and as well as Rick and Christian Sutton stepped in and helped with the live streaming broadcast. We appreciate everyone. We'll be back next time for the Christmas parade. That's in December. Looking Won't be forward long. to it. Hoping it'll be cooler. That's thanks. right. Thanks for joining us.